wasn't for me. The only other thing that I knew how to do was talk to people. Mm -hmm. So I was like, okay, I guess sales? I don't know. Okay. Yeah. So I jumped into different sales roles. I don't know how much, how far you want me to go into that. Tell me a couple of sales jobs that you went into. <laughs> well, I sold water. You which, sold water. Which is the least sexy thing you can possibly sell on the face of the earth. You, you uh, learned how to sell water, something that's free, to, <laughs> yeah. to the world. And you learn how to sell that. That tell me, tell me about that job, selling water. Yeah. Oh, it was uh, it was interesting because that was like my first like I don't know, real sales job. I had experience in uh, Kenosha, but that was much more like relationship management. Okay. My job in Kenosha was just like connecting the two pieces of the company, so just like securing meetings and things along those lines. This was much more like the full sales cycle. So I had to convince people, like you mentioned to buy water, which is essentially free. Uh -huh. So that was extremely hard, but that was also probably the best learning experience I could have had from a sales perspective. Because like you said, you have to take something that's free and create all these distinctions and all these uh, reasons for people to purchase this from you. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you just gotta pull them out of thin air, mm -hmm. which is good. It's good to have that sort of uh, skill no matter what profession you're in so it, it's still I mean it still turned out pretty well I sold I moved some water so you're you're obviously